First to 10, after more than a year of research, the Dayton unit of the NAACP Economic Development Committee is sharing its findings. Tennis reporter Deborah Bogart was at the town hall. It's new at 10. That's right, local economic experts making up that committee. They've been focusing for the past year on three economic factors in the West Dayton area, and those are housing, education, and wealth equality. Tonight, some members of the Dayton Unit NAACP Economic Development Committee briefing NAACP members on their efforts from the past year in the West Dayton area, including Trotwood and Jefferson and Harrison Townships, saying they had three specific concepts they focused on housing, education, and wealth equality. They spent the year interviewing different local, regional, and state officials to look at how these concepts played into workforce development and try to set measurable goals. We have the ideas from the different people who are in economics, whether they're at, at a university level or at a jurisdictional, jurisdictional level with their economic development committees or community uh, departments. We're taking that information in terms of the initiatives and also what companies are looking for when they come into an area with the different tax incentives or the different opportunity zones. Winburn says right now they are still in the middle of sorting out the bigger picture and are trying to determine exactly what those specific objectives are. We also have to look at, you know, some of the brownfields and greenfields right now. Maybe some we have to stress with some of those individuals that there's opportunity here. You may be the first person there, but look at the opportunity there. Woodburn says they are compiling all of that information from their research into a narrative or booklet that will be out soon. Now, there's no final date yet for that complete version, but he hopes to have something a little more concrete by December. Deborah Bogart, 2 News, working for you.